So Star Willow made a great video about Disney World theme parks. Well, any theme parks, really. Where people are annoying. And I was like, oh, I want to tell my story. Because uh, I feel like working at a college dorm dining hall is like a theme park, in my opinion. Or anywhere, really. Well, I had to deal with the dumbest people, and I always question, how the hell did they get into college? Because if it's that easy to get into college, can I join? Because they do the dumbest things. Like, you're walking with a cart, and you're trying to get to the salad bar to put dishes away that the salad bar needs because you just got them cleaned in the dish room. They don't move out of your fucking way. And you're like, excuse me, could you please move? Excuse me. They feel like if they get out of line, they feel like if they get out of line, they're going to lose their spot when that's not true. You'll get your spot back. Just move. It's not that hard. Or if they're walking to go get food or walking to the table, they go really slow and walk really slowly knowing I'm behind them trying to do my job and I need to hurry and you're in the fucking way. Like if you want to walk fucking slow or talking with your friend or not pay attention where you're walking, move to the side, out of the way. Like there's some people that'll be in line and they'll chit chat with their friend and they're up next in line, and I'm just standing there like, can I help you? And they're just, chat, 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 beep, 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 beep. Or they're on their phone, and it's like, get the fuck off your phone and order your damn food. Or, they come up to me, and they're like, I want a salad. Okay. Well, I gotta have something to put it in, right? So, well, usually before the COVID, we would have people get their own salads. And since there's COVID now, that, that's not allowed. So I always have to ask them, are you eating it here or are you taking it to go? Because if you're taking it to go, take it to go. They always say, oh, I want a to-go box. And then we put it in a to-go box. And then they're sitting at the table eating it. And it's like, dude, you got a to-go box. Meaning, go with it. Take it out of here. Don't. Because I'll be in the dish room and I would see a bunch of to-go boxes on the belt. And I'm thinking, why didn't you take that to-go? That's the reason why you got it to-go. We're trying to save the to-go's for people that actually are taking them to-go. And giving you plates, throwaway plates, for when you're eating inside. So it's kind of annoying. And I'd be like, you want it to go? What do you want? Are you eating here? I'm always like, here to go. Here to go. It's like, you know you're going to be asked that because every station you go to, they ask you that. And if you've been there several times, you should know that by now. And obviously, if I see a bunch of to-go boxes in your hands, then I know it's a to-go. But you should obviously tell me what you want. Instead of me having to ask. Or they'll come up to me. Or they'll go to the sandwich bar. And we have to make them a sandwich. They go. I want a sandwich. Well duh. I know you want a fucking sandwich. That's why you're at the sandwich bar. We don't have. Other foods here. Besides sandwiches. You donut. And then they'd be like. Okay, I would take American cheese. Actually, they don't even say American cheese. They just go, I'll take some cheese and some ham. And I'm like, why do we eat? Because I need to know what bread to put it on. You don't want me to go in there and grab just whatever bread. And then you go, oh, no, I wanted the other one. Well, you didn't say that. You know I'm going to be asking you what bread you want. So fucking say, when you walk up, don't. Walk up to me and go, I want a sandwich. No, walk up to me and go, white bread, please. And then I'd go get the white bread, bring it out, fold. And then, and then don't go, 
I want cheese. Because I want to be like, what cheese do you want? Well, what cheese do you got? Do you not know your cheeses? Are you blind? If you know what cheese you like, just say I want American. Even if you don't know what the other cheeses are. Duh. And then they're like, I'll take cheddar. Are you blind? Do you not see cheddar? Look at the cheeses. Do you see cheddar as a cheese? No, you don't. Because it's American. I, if you like cheddar, then please learn what cheddar and American look like. Obviously, if you like cheddar, you should know what cheddar looks like. It looks like it's been out for five hours, and the American looks like it just came out. Because one's darker than the other. Yes. And then when I say, and then when you say, I would like some honey mustard on my sandwich. Oh, if you want mustard, honey mustard, you have to get it at the <laughs> salad dressing. Because we don't have it here. And they're like, uh, ew, no, that's okay. Dude, it's the same damn thing. If we had it, if we had it in a bottle, honey mustard dressing in a bottle, sitting there, I could do Chipotle ranch and vinegar, you'd be like, I'll take some honey mustard in that bottle. Not knowing it's the same thing as salad dressing. Because we use the same thing. Like, hello. Are you dumb? Of course they are. Or, if you're out of cheese on the salad bar, and they go, I want lettuce. And then I would like, no, I was out of carrots last night. And they were like, I'll take some carrots. And I'm like, uh, are you blind? It's empty. Hello. We don't have any carrots. It's all gone. Like, they want me to scrape it off the sides and, and try to get as much carrots as I can into the thing. And I'm like, dude, I'm not getting paid enough to do that for you. And when I was on the line, they'd be like, I want chicken. And I went, because we had chicken that night, and they were like, I want chicken, I want this, this, and this, and I'm like, do you want it here, are you going to eat it here, or do you want it to go, I'll take it to go, is that the biggest you have, of it to go, yes, because we're out of the big ones, oh, well, I want chicken, and then right after they ask for chicken, the whole chicken is so big, that it fits around the whole thing, but they want me to put mashed potatoes or what was it? It was like meatballs in it and and and, and the collard greens and stuff in it with the chicken. It's like how am I supposed to do this? If you, I'm not gonna get another to go unless you say, can can I have the sides in another to go? And. People are just, they just, they're just, I don't know. I don't do cashews, so I don't know how dumb they are there. And I bet you, they couldn't, when, I don't know if they do this, because I don't do text mix, but I bet you, if they, if, if they do it in my area, they probably do it at text mix too, going, I want a taco. Okay, do you want a soft taco or a hard shell taco dumb nut or they'd be like i want meat which meat do you want do you want chicken or taco meat or they'd be like i want a tortilla okay are you wanting a quesadilla or are you wanting a burrito out of that tortilla like, tell us exactly what you want. Because if we start making one thing, and then you go, Okay, I want that toasted. Or, as a quesadilla, it's like, oh, we didn't know. So we put too much in it, and now it's going to make a mess in our machine. 
idiot. Or what really pisses me off is they're like, I want it toasted. They want their sandwich toasted, which is fine. So we put it in the red thing and we toast it. And then we pull it out. And then they're like, okay, now I want to add this, this, and this. I'm like, really? You just put cheese in a sandwich. Do you not know what cheese does in a sandwich? It fucking melts the shit. So it's hard. And, and, and when I touch it, even with gloves on, it's hard to pull apart so I can add more shit on your damn sandwich. Because... The sandwich is hot, and the cheese is melted to the other side of it. So, half the time when I'm pulling it, I'm getting just bread on the other side with some cheese stuck to it. And it's hard to pull apart. And then I have to apologize, saying, look how dumb you are. Or you go to get them, you know, food, like cookies, and they're like, I want... The whole row of cookies, like, what the fuck, dude, you're probably not even going to eat it all. And you want the whole row? Can't you be respectful in case this is all we have? So other people that want a cookie can have one? I mean, I could have been rude and go, I'm sorry, I can only give you one or two cookies. But I'm too nice, and I don't have the heart to say no. And then, or... They'd be like, I want three apples. And then you're trying to get three apples in the smaller thing. It's like, it won't fit. And it's like, dude, do you not realize it won't fit in these damn things? And they don't, they're not respectful on that. And then, then they're like, I want a banana. I'm not going to grab a fucking banana and put it in a to-go and say, here you go. I'm just going to hand it to them because what's the point, you know? That's a waste thing but they could have been nice enough to open one of their to-go's and I throw it in there but no so let me just set it on the thing and they grab and what's rude is sometimes we have these dividers up like but they're not all the way around like they should be because and they didn't make the holes big enough so the small to-go boxes don't fit through them <laughs> And so we have to get to them on the side. And then if we have some foods or silverware on the side, they're, they're grabbing over the behind the thing and grabbing them. And it's like, dude, one, you're not supposed to do that. And two, did you forget that we're in a fucking pandemic? And that you don't, we're in a fucking pandemic, which means we're not wearing these masks for fashion dumb nut we're actually wearing them for a fucking reason and if you put your dirty hands the reason why we don't let you serve yourself is because we don't want to get corona on us if you have it dumbass and if you reach over and grab something then it's grabbing you're touching the one that's next to it and so on and then they're terminated and then we have to throw them all away and get new ones because of you and that's a waste. Like, just ask. And and if I was them, I wouldn't put it fucking close to the dam where they can reach over and grab it. But I, another thing they did that pissed me off was, did you forget we're in a pandemic when you decided, oh, there's a table, but there's only so many chairs. But I have so many friends that want to sit with me. Let's get in a big group, take our mask off, and eat, and then not leave when we're done. Not kill it when a pandemic, and then not put the chairs back on the other table when we leave, and make us do it. Like one, that's rude. And second of all, the reason the tables are the way and the chairs are the way they are is because we're in a pandemic. Dumb, dumb, six feet apart, retard. Anyways, I don't like using that word, but, so I don't know why I said it, so I'm sorry. I just got overheated. But I'm going to get going, and I'll talk to you guys later. And remember, wear a mask, save a life, and don't get into big groups, because that's not saving a life unless you're all wearing a mask. And later, haters!